Hello guys, you're watching Geek Sample Days, another, another review on the channel. Today we're going to be doing something very interesting indeed. We're going to be doing um, basically uh, why the Weevils should come into Doctor Who. And here's how they would do it. So obviously the big main question is, but they rip people's throats out. There's loads of blood, there's loads of guts. This shouldn't be used for a children's show. For that I can say, here's an idea for you. Um, so I think the Weevils should uh, come back to Doctor Who and be like an Ood aspect. So basically they are slowly like linked within each other, like the Ood. The Ood can talk to each other through a telepathic thing. So can Weevils. We've seen this in Torchwood. Weevils can talk to other Weevils. They connect telepathically and they talk throughout their minds and stuff, which obviously us humans can't understand and can't hear. However... There's an episode right there they can use from that. They can actually learn about a telepathic episode of these weevils and how they've been used in the sewers and stuff like this. And you can find out why, why they may have devolved and may, may have been like this. Why are they savages? Because obviously if you're telepathic, you can kind of think they're quite an intelligent race maybe because uh, humans can't be telepathic. So I'd love to see an episode around that. However, we've also got um, another thing that I, I think could take it to the extreme. However, it could dampen them as well. So here we go. This is my idea. So uh, in the uh, Pandarica Opens, we have a weevil. A weevil that basically uh, doesn't try and rip anyone's throat out, doesn't do a typical weevil thing. It just stands there, obviously, because... Oh, we need as many monsters as we can to make this look a, a, epic and amazing. Put a weevil there. Um, so, with that into play, imagine if that weevil was an intelligent weevil that could talk to humans like a professor sort of thing. Now, that would be weird and very unusual for a weevil to do. Talking like a professor, very clever. And imagine if that was a thing. That would be hilarious, but also interesting to see how this weevil um is more clever than the others and we can learn off him and then for him to maybe uh show what happened to his species maybe the weevils were intelligent species until eventually they devolved somehow and we could learn an episode on that and i think that would be very cool and then we later learn that that was one of the weevils who was in the pan uh, creating the doctor to be in the pandarica you know, um, there could have been a, a one-liner going, Ah, yes, Doctor, I remember you. I was there trying to trap you in that Pandarka box one day. Anyway, look at this. Look at these readings. Very interesting indeed. You know, it could be very interesting to see. Now, obviously, you're still going to show the rapid and rampage craziness of a weevil and it ripping people's throat out. You're still going to get that in Doctor Who. But obviously it's a kids show, so we're not going to show the actual scenes. It's going to be off screen. We, we hear the screams, but we know what it is because we've seen Torchwood. So us fans can go, oh, that's how obviously our minds are going to think, blah, 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 blah. But on, on, when, it, when the kids are watching, they're going to go, oh, it's that villain just killed that guy somehow. You know, that's going to be what it's going to be thinking. And I think that's the best way to do a Weevil episode in Doctor Who. Show it off screen, maybe learn about a telepathic episode or something along them lines. And I would really be interested to see it. Would you be interested to see a Weevil episode in Doctor Who? Obviously, the main answer is you can't do that because it's a kid show. I've just explained my idea and why you can. So let me know your thoughts down below. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video and subscribe to the channel. So we're trying to get to the channel goal before the end of the year. And as always, I'll see you guys in the video very soon. Have a nice day.